At the RBS Six Nations launch, Sarah, does this make it all real now? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you always look to the Six Nations as a highlight of the, the rugby calendar and, and now we're here, the launch of it, it's, it's ever closer. It's still not quite there, it's still a, a week away, but this makes it sort of kick off and the excitement buzzing, talking to all the other captains. It's, uh, it's a real, uh, real exciting time. How are the squad feeling? Yeah, I think we're in a really positive place. Um, we, we had a two-day camp at the start of January and I think we're just itching to bits to get back together again. I mean, we'll have four days in, in camp together from Thursday to Sunday, um, which will give us some real good preparation time looking forward to, to Scotland. The Autumn Internationals gave us um, that platform to see where we're at and put some things in, into, into practice and getting that win at the Stoop against Ireland in, in the manner that we did, I think it, it gave us that, that push on from the, the France game and, and certainly we know it wasn't perfect and we know there's still room to work on so that's what the four day camp will be, hopefully get some confidence off the back of a win against Ireland going into the Six Nations. Is there a point to prove from England? Yeah, I think last year, obviously, finishing fourth, we, we, we're not going to shy away from that. We know it wasn't where we set our standards. So um, we'll be looking for, for a team performance and individual performances and uh, certainly wanting to do, to do better than we did last year.